playhouse assembler said he would charge us $500 to assemble our playhouse. How long do you think it would take me to do it? How many hours of my labor will it take to save me 500 bucks? And how much per hour will I end up paying myself to do this job? Must have pulled out 200 of these or so. So I don't think this is very fair, but you have to buy, separate from this expensive kit, you have to buy six two by two by six for the base to put the platform on. Buying base slats, Home Depot nightmare, wherein my ATM card chip wouldn't work, so I had to go to the bank to make a cash withdrawal, then go back to Home Depot, refine my lumber, then drive back home two hours. I split the wood, which makes me crazy because I pre-drilled. I think the key to doing this yourself are these welding clamps and their 11R vice grips. Definitely need one of these. So I put this thing together facing the wrong way. So the door is facing the street. I need the door to face this way. I gotta turn this whole contraption around. It just doesn't. It's like it, it's like in a perfect world, yes. These were perfect laser cut. See, this is supposed to fit into here, but it's like, it just doesn't. And it's like, uh, take it apart, pull the back, cut the groove out. So now it fits nicely. See, cut that out. So the wood they use is very poor quality. This wood shipped, it was split, and then they you can see they glued it right there. And so now I have to do a mending plate right here so that this doesn't break. So that's a little steel that should maybe secure this crack a little bit, we'll see. This is the wrong piece. The directions don't really indicate that this is a different type of wood. So I, I use this and it's supposed to be this. So I have to, I have to swap it. These are the roofing nails. But I can't, you know, get a hammer on them. So I have to make a little tool. All right. Still doesn't shut. I smashed my head on the rafter. Uh, kids already moved in, but still have to do the trim. The door doesn't shut properly. Um, the glass isn't put in correctly. It's just push pins. More trim, more trim, more trim, trim, trim. And I still gotta tack the last piece of roof felt onto the roof. Probably three and a half more hours of work. I mean, there's no way this kid's getting a security deposit back on this one, so probably I'll break even. The following is a paid promotion.
I learned to fix things by taking things apart when I was a little kid. This is a soda stream I made out of a soda stream in 2017. I was reminded of my soda stream when it came time to make this ad for Unfabricate who backed my Kickstarter for this channel. Unfabricate is a startup focused on reusing and repurposing old electronics in order to extend the life of our devices. Their first product is the kit that gives you everything you need to turn your broken device into exploded wall art. The kit comes with tools and instructions on how to take your device apart and mount it to the kit. You need zero technical ability to make these. They've got kits for all the major devices. You can choose from a dark kit or a light kit. Choose from a physical or digital delivery. This would be pretty fun to do with a kit, I bet. Thank you, Unfabricate, for supporting my Kickstarter. Link in the description. This week on the Patreon, a live stream answering your questions. The link is right there.